What up, G-Life? It's your boy, MC Shadow, back at you with another video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, check out the playlist. The playlist on top of my videos in the own folders makes the video you're looking for a lot easier, whether it's reactions, the G-Series, all that, then on the own folders that we don't have to keep scrolling. Don't forget to check out my second channel, Madness Society, MOD, where we talk about stuff outside of the streets. Now, what I want to talk about was something that um, I've been getting asked a shitload, multiple questions, so I'm just going to do one video, you know, talking about it all. Um... You know, I, I know like one of my homies was telling me like, yeah, you should do, you know, one per video that we get more views. Look, it's not about the views, not about the likes. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't even like talking about stuff like this, you know, but like I said, homies hit me up on the cash app. You know, I comply. got no choice but to comply what the subscribers want, you know. But uh, but other than that, on my emails, I had, I think it was no light to you guys. I think it was like 160 something emails, you know, of individuals telling me to talk about this, 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 and that. I was like, damn. I was like, all right, all right. I normally don't like talking about none of this, but like I said, I'm going to the cash app. Now, I'm going to tell you guys why I talk about certain ones and not and other ones I don't. Um, you know, we'll get on, into it, all of them right here on this one. Um, one of the ones I was asked was about what are my thoughts about Swifty Blue saying he's going to piss the whip uh, a hater world. On that one, I'm going to say that that's none of my business, bro. Um, that's between them two individuals, what they got going on. Um, you know, there's I really don't have an opinion to that. You know, that's between them individuals and, you know, how they see each other and, you know, what they want to do, you know. Um, doesn't concern me. Um, you know what I mean? Um, that's their pedo. Um, so there's not much I can say to that, you know what I mean? I'm not going to pick one side or the other, say who's right and who's wrong. Like I said, it's between them two individuals. Um, so as for that one. Um, you know, I really don't, I don't say so. Um, dispensa, you know, that's just the way it is. You know, that's just how I get down. Um, the next one is on my thoughts on the whole Mr. Capone and SPM. Now, why am I going to speak on this one? This one, because not only because I was asked by my subscribers, you know, got to comply with the subscribers say, but they're public figures, right? They're, um, they're in the music industry, the genre, you know, of, you know, raza, music, and the culture, and all of that, right? So it involves the raza and the culture of, you know, my people, and all of that, right? And they're public figures. They throw themselves out there, so uh, obviously no one's immune to criticism. So that's why we're going to shoot it right here. Um, You know, Dope House Rakers has came out and said that, you know, they have evidence saying that Capone, you know, has some weird old charges on him. Or whatever. And here's what I'm going to say to that, because I've seen the videos where these individuals talk about, you know, Mr. Capone, he's got, you know, underage women and blah, 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 blah. In this world that we come from, the streets, right? No one's going to hear you. They don't give a fuck how many pictures you have, how many emails, messages, or how many. Blah, blah, blah. My boy, in this world that we come from, you come with the black and white or you don't come at all, bro. That's it. As plain as simple as that, bro. You come with the black and white. You know, they've, you know, trialed this motherfucker. They convicted him and he's found guilty and he's, you know, all that. You come with the evidence. The black and white. Or you don't come at all and you don't even bring up the matter. You don't even speak about the subject if you don't have black and white. Because you could get yourself in some shit by doing that. It's either black and white or it's nothing at all, bro. You may not like it. You know, you may say that that's some bullshit. You can feel however you want, bro. That's cool. You're entitled to feel however you want. But it doesn't change the facts, bro. You either come with black and white or you don't come at all, bro. I, You know how many times people here, trust me, take my word for it. Trust me, dang, hey, I got evidence. Nah, they wouldn't be lying. And then it turns out that puro pedo. And even by some serious, solid individuals, and it turns out that they were just mad at the moment or, or whatever, and now you're stuck in a situation, now you're in some shit because you repeated what that fool was saying. Doesn't matter that he's the one that shot you the info and you got it from him. They're going to wonder why you were saying it and repeating it. They ain't giving a fuck about him no more. It's about you now. So you either come with the black and white or you don't come in at all. It don't matter how long you've known this person, if he's your doggy dog, unless he has the proof, my boy, then, you, then that's just he said, she said, boy. 
And that's the real talk, bro, because no one's going to take your word for it, homie. You either come with the facts or you don't come at all, bro. I'm sorry to say that's just how the streets work, bro. There's no in-betweens, no none of that. You know, so until they come with the black and white, my boy, I mean. There's black and white on this PM, bro. It's been convicted and booked and charged and everything, bro. It's all there. You can feel how you want and still try to hate on Mr. Capone for whatever reason. That's fine. You're entitled to dislike him for whatever reason you dislike him for. But don't make up shit. And don't speak on stuff that you, if you really don't know, if you really don't have the facts. Truth of the matter is, on SPM food, there's facts. Paperwork. You may not like it, how, how it works, how the program is. That's fine. You can feel however you want, bro. It doesn't change the facts. It doesn't change what it is, and it doesn't change how it works. And I'm not here to be an asshole. I'm just here to call it for simply for how it is, bro, when no bullshit's attached. Now, that's for that matter. Now the little Kelpie uh, issue. Why on the little Kelpie issue? Because he brought up a group, you know, and spoke about a side in which, you know, it involves a lot of people and, and you know, and all that, you know. So we, we were entitled to give our opinion on it. And because, like I said, my subscribers wanted to know. The little Kelpie saying that <laughs> if he was to be busted, he would run with the suit. That's cool. If that's how he chooses to see it. Now, I'm not going to say, will they accept them or if they won't accept them, whatever. That's none of my business to speak on, on YouTube, you know, what they will or what they won't do. But I, what I can tell you is that stay in school, boy. Stop talking about stuff that you have no idea about. Um, this is not cool. You're going to get yourself in some shit, bro. You know, bringing up, you know, certain hoods and talking about certain situations or that they'll back your plate up if this guy goes there and stuff like that. Don't do that, bro. Don't do that kind of stuff, bro. These guys don't take that shit cool. They don't like when people be trying to throw them in there if they really have no connection to them. Like, who the fuck are you to say what we will and we won't do? You know, or for you or whatever. <laughs> don't do that, bro. You playing with fire, homie. Um... You know, some people will give you the benefit because they see you. Oh, he's just a cool white kid. There's some people that are not going to care, bro. They don't give a damn what anybody or how anybody sees it. Like, hey, that's messed up. He doesn't bag. Leave him alone. They're not going to care, bro. Sympathy is not in their nature. You know, just don't do that. Don't speak about gangs and none of that, bro. You know, like, you just don't want to do that. And if you get locked up, I guarantee you, bro, it's not fun and games, bro. You won't last. It's, it's it, like I said, it's not even cool or to be down or nothing like that. Bro, just stay in school. Earn money the legit way, the real way. Legitly, you know, go to school, educate yourself, get yourself a good job. That's what every homie wishes, you know, they would have done and wishes that they would do, you know, or want to do. Not the other way around, bro. Real individuals look up to homies that have their own businesses and doing everything le the legit way. Um, that's what homies look up to and, and what homies, you know, what, what, we, that's what, if you want to, uh, how can I say, if you want to wow homies or if you want to impress homies, that's how you do it by getting your education and doing it the right way. That's how you'll really wow these individuals. But this way, pretending, faking, lying, <laughs> you're doing the opposite of what you think you're doing. But those are my opinions on those subjects. Like I said, I'm not going to be doing, you know, individual videos and breaking down for you. I don't even like speaking about matters like this. That's something I might get down. Um, no shots at the ones that do it. You know what I mean? Uh, that If that's their thing, then that's their thing. You know, a toda madre, you know, good shit. I, I'm just different. You know, I just don't like doing that. Not because it's wrong or anything like that, but that's just, you know, I like, it's not how I work. You know, I do me. But overall, that's just my opinions on the matters um, and how I see them. Um, and shadow we up.